Hello Interweb. I'm going to be talking about... I'm going to be doing a book review today. I'm going to talk about A Song of Fire and Ice. So the whole series, not just one book. Because I finished reading this, I think, the second week in January. Anyway, I haven't got the, any of the books here because I've lent them to my sisters. And they're both currently reading them. So what I wanted to say is I love the very first book. The second book, not as much, but I still enjoyed it. And then what I seemed to find was the books got more and more complicated and everything. Now, the whole fantasy series is amazing in the sense of it's so deep and complex and they've create, he's created this entire world and I find it's amazing when people create these entire worlds and run them. But what I found with the books and the storyline was, because obviously the series hasn't finished yet, we just got to the end of uh, A Dance of Dragons, it's like, mm, it's just there's magic and there's all these other stuff and I'm not too keen on the magic side of it, although that's just me because I find it as this extra complicated thing that just doesn't fit to me. It doesn't fit as well. It may do eventually, but it just doesn't to me, and I find it awkward. And I think there's too many characters that we're going from, and some of them just feel like they're pointless. They don't feel like you need to know what they're talking about, why we're hearing from them at all. And maybe we, maybe it will when we get to the end of the book, end of the series, it'll be like, oh, it makes perfect sense. That's exactly right. You need to know that it all fits into one. But I kind of, it took a while for me to get through the last. Uh, probably the last few books, after the first part of the third one, I think after that it started getting hard for me to get through because I just found it was waffling. Maybe it's all important knowledge and we need to know it all, but to me it was just waffle and I'm extremely good at waffling personally, but it's just, I just found it taxing um, and it was hard to get through and I'm completely at this point now where I'm just like, why? We're at this point where it's like, I don't understand what's going on. I don't know why this happened. How is this going to make any sense? But, you know, it might do. It might make perfect sense. When we get there. God knows. How long that'll take. I don't like the TV series either. Not that this is about the TV series, but I don't. Um, and, yeah. Same thing. Not, like, talking about characters and how pointless I feel some of them are. I really don't like Danny. Makes me probably like one of the very few people who don't like Danny, but I just hate Danny. She annoys me, and I don't understand her revel her relevance to the whole storyline at the moment. I kind of get it, she's going to be important, but she's fucking about over in whatever area she is with her slavers and everything, fucking about over there instead of going over and sorting out over the other end. And I'm just like, oh, whatever. What are you? Move on. Hate reading her chapters. Hate the Greyjoys. I, I grew to like Jamie, although I think he's prat. So grew to kind of like his thoughts. Cersei, I hate. Kill that bitch. Already. Um, yeah, I don't know what else to say, but anyway. Catch you next time. I'll do another review soon, hopefully. Get through these books that I've read. And uh, see you later.